in the courtroom today. This 15 year old kid drives her monster truck on top of my car and she needs to pay. I didn't wreck nothing, the truck wrecked itself. A truck with a mind of its own and a teen with a lame excuse. Model Dawn Livingston is suing a vehicle owner and the driver who crashed into her car. Defendants Latanya Anthony and 15 year old Jasmine Baker say they're not responsible. Now, here's Judge Joe Brown. The plaintiff claims that the defendant is liable to her for damaging her parked Honda Civic. She claims her vehicle was struck by a Ford Explorer operated by the defendant, number two. And defendant number one is the actual owner of the vehicle. Who drove the vehicle? Who was it? you? You're number two? Yes. That explains it. You're supposed to be over there. I thought you were going to, yeah, there you go. Tell me what happened. Okay, um, October 24th, about 1.30 p.m., my friends and I were getting ready to take a trip to Santa Barbara. So we're packing up my friend's Jeep, and I was getting everything out of my car, my Honda Civic, and I see a person that I thought was older than me, that appeared to be older than me, in a Ford Explorer, um, drive into a van, back up, drive into the van again. By this time, the van's front wheels are on the sidewalk. Um, I see my, fr my other friend go up to her and ask her if she's okay, if she needs help parking, anything. She says, yeah, I'll leave a note. She asks her if she's going to leave a note. She says she'll leave a note. I, I keep walking to my other friend's car to put my stuff in her car. I see her back up onto someone's lawn. And then I throw my stuff into the back of my friend's Jeep, and I hear a loud crash, crumpling noises, and I look over, and I see this her is the car funny part. drive on top of my car. Yeah, her car is on, on top. top of you. And I have these pictures, <laughs> too. Yeah, all right. There you go. And you can see her, she's in the pictures. Hold on a second, yeah. Can I add... Hold um, on, hold okay. on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to the defendant. How do you manage to get it to do that? Well, I didn't wreck the car, the car wrecked itself. <laughs> hey, girl, I'd be very scared of you now. How you manage to get car not with you in it, operate itself? Well, when the car was going on top of the other car, I already jumped out, so therefore, I was not in the vehicle, so the vehicle wrecked itself. Oh, my God. Where did, what, what, oh, I see the location. You're on the flight path to LAX. What happened? Air traffic controllers got you confused, didn't get proper altitude on the approach? I guess so. You wound up on top. Let, let, let's go to... Can I, can I so wait, 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 let's go back to this, that one. How do you manage to do that? You jumped out of the vehicle after it started to do its own thing. Yep. How does it manage to take off on its own? Easily. <laughs> it just takes off. You didn't touch the accelerator. It just got a mind of its own and it's ass. <laughs> what happened? The car went off by itself. What do you mean it went off by itself? <laughs> How did that happen? Can, can I add wait, 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 go ahead, tell okay. me. When I went over to her while she was still in the car, and the car was stopped while her car was on top of my car, and I say, this is my car, she goes, oh, don't worry about it, I'll pay for everything. I said, you're going to pay for these three cars that you just said. She's like, three yeah, cars. just help me get the car off. Just help me get the car down. Why are you guys How are you going to get a 5,000 pound SUV off of the car? We were going to call the police. Wait a minute, wait, 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 and wait, she wait, said, wait, excuse me. Yeah. Why didn't you just talk to the car? If the car put itself <laughs> up there, why didn't you just go over and be nice? Say, baby. You know, it'd be okay. No. Mama was very sorry that uh, she offended you. Could you come down off of there, please, baby? That's dangerous up there. You need, baby, you need to come on off. Go pat it on the hood. There you go, baby. Come on back down. Be a good car. Good car. Are you serious? Don't I look serious? That's the problem. <laughs> you do. May I ask you a question? Why did you take this car? Because I wanted to go get something to eat. You don't even have a learner's permit. Why did you take this car? Because I wanted to. So what? Why'd you do it? It ain't your car. I took the car because I wanted to go get something to she eat. She said, 
I ain't got time to go drive you. I'm not your chauffeur. I'm your brother's girlfriend. Now, and that's my brother's girlfriend. Did you, excuse me. And what? Give me the rest of it. And that's my brother's girlfriend. She can text me to go get something to eat. Why would a grown woman with a job, her own place, take a little 15-year-old and play chauffeur for her? Cause she's got to get a hammer. Why don't you wait till it was time for everybody to eat? No. No. <laughs> no. Luckily, it's, luckily her whole, baby whole, wasn't with her, because oh, she, she could have injured her, her child, too. How old is your child? Four months. Do, do, do you get this picture? This is broad daylight. It isn't like this, like 8, 9, 10, 11 o'clock at night. You can't go without food for that long? No. Where were you? No. Because I just knocked at home from school. We'll be right back with Judge Joe Brown. I just bought that car last August. I've only had it a year, and I just had to buy another car this year. I'm just two years out of college. I don't have a lot of money to be buying cars every year because I'm the one wants to drive on top of it. It's Joe time after this. We're back with Judge Joe Brown. The plaintiff in this case was packing up her car for a getaway to Santa Barbara when she heard crashing sounds. She looked up to see a 15-year-old girl driving a truck right onto the hood of her car. Let's take a look. You're going to come back, visit your brother's girlfriend, and you're going to defiantly tell her, look, you're going to take me to get something to eat. Is that yep. what she did? Yes, Your Honor. Tell me about she, what happened. Well, I was actually asleep when the incident happened. She took my keys. I was asleep at the time. Did she ask you? Well, she asked me to take her to get something to eat, and I told her I wasn't going right then. You work at night? No, I was just asleep. Oh, you just And she oh, okay. actually stole my keys. All I know, his, her, uh, my boyfriend's mom called on the phone and was like, Tanya, somebody hit your vehicle again, because about three weeks ago, my car was sideswiped by a 19-year-old. My truck was sideswiped by a 19-year-old. Did you see that? I didn't see, no. Might that have been a 15-year-old riding in this possessed vehicle that told you it was a 19-year-old? No. No. Where were you going? What hamburger? Burger King. Burger King? Right down the street from our house. Right down the street from your house? What do you mean, right down the street from your house? A couple of blocks there. down the street from my and house. And you said, why didn't you walk? Walk? No. <laughs> You couldn't walk two blocks? No. What's wrong with you? I don't walk nowhere. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. You have servants? I got a mama that got a vehicle, so basically, so therefore, she's your servant. I get to where I got to get. So if they don't take you, you put a hex on? <laughs> if you yep. don't take me where I want to go, your vehicle will come alive. You a mama? Yes. Come on. She act like this all the time. Stand up here. What's wrong with her? I mean, you don't look like a chauffeur. Do you? I mean, no, you, I'm not you, no you got some. Well, well, what's her problem? Like, you got to take her everywhere, including two blocks. Supposed she to don't got to, but she'll do it. So that's why you don't. I look, I don't walk anywhere. Man, I, I mean, that's amazing. Fifteen-year-olds don't walk anywhere, even two blocks. They ride. Somebody rolls them. I wish I'd been able to get chauffeured around everywhere I went when I was 15. People got, did you, did, did, you, did you like being characterized like that? Like, my mama got a car, so if I no, want to go someplace. Nothing like that, believe. What is she talking about? I have no idea. What's wrong with you? Nothing. I mean, they've they been putting something in the burgers at Burger King that <laughs> gives you this craving, this... This thing where you get withdrawal symptoms if you can't have at 1.30 in the afternoon uh, a double cheese with fries and a side salad. What's the matter? I wanted something to eat. So, so when I want something right to eat, now, I'd rather be drinking some red wine and chilling right now, <laughs> but I'm earning my living. So, I mean, we can't always do what we want to do when that thing we got she, to do. I can what? She can't, I can. What makes you so special? Because I'm Jasmine. Jasmine? You special? Yes. She's very special. 
Better watch her. She put hexes on cars. <laughs> it just backfired. I'm sure she could. What you got to say about that? I'm carless. I have no vehicle. Why didn't you sue her? See, you know you can. See what's happening as real deal in the courtroom today. This 15 year old kid drives her monster truck on top of my car and she needs to pay. I didn't wreck nothing. The truck wrecked itself. A truck with a mind of its own and a teen with a lame excuse. Model Don Livingston is suing a vehicle owner and the driver who crashed into her car. Defendants Latanya Anthony and 15 year old Jasmine Baker say they're not responsible. Now, here's Judge Joe Brown. Plaintiff claims that the defendant is liable to her for damaging her parked Honda Civic. She claims her vehicle was struck by a Ford Explorer operated by the defendant, number two. And defendant number one is the actual owner of the vehicle. Who drove the vehicle? Who was it? you? You're number two? Yes. That explains it. You're supposed to be over there. I thought you were going to, yeah, there you go. Tell me what happened. Okay, um, October 24th, about 1.30 p.m., my friends and I were getting ready to take a trip to Santa Barbara. So we're packing up my friend's Jeep, and I was getting everything out of my car, my Honda Civic. And I see a person that I thought was older than me, that appeared to be older than me, in a Ford Explorer, um, drive into a van, back up, drive into the van again. By this time, the van's front wheels are on the sidewalk. Um, I see my, fr my other friend go up to her and ask her if she's okay, if she needs help parking, anything. She says, yeah, I'll leave a note. She asks her if she's going to leave a note. She says she'll leave a note. I, I keep walking to my other friend's car to put my stuff in her car. I see her back up onto someone's lawn. And then I throw my stuff into the back of my friend's Jeep, and I hear a loud crash, crumpling noises, and I look over, and I see this is her the car funny part. drive on top of my car. Yeah, her car on, on top. top of you. And I have these pictures, too. <laughs> yeah, all right. There you go. And you can see her, she's in the pictures. Hold on a second, yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm, anyway. Can I add... Um, hold on, hold okay. on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to the defendant. How do you manage to get it to do that? Well, I didn't wreck the car, the car wrecked itself. <laughs> hey, girl, I'd be very scared of you now. How you manage to get car not with you in it, operate self? Well, when the car was going on top of the other car, I already jumped out, so therefore, I was not in the vehicle, so the vehicle wrecked itself. Oh, my God. Where did, what, what, oh, I see the location. You're on the flight path to LAX. What happened? Air traffic controllers got you confused, didn't get proper altitude on the approach? I guess so. You wound up on t let, let, Let's go to... Can I, can I so add wait, 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 let's go back to this, that one, how do you manage to do that, you jumped out of the vehicle, after it started to do its own thing, yep, how does it manage to take off on its own, easily, <laughs> it just takes off, you didn't touch the accelerator. It just got a mind of its own and it says, mm. <laughs> What happened? The car went off by itself. What do you mean it went off by itself? <laughs> How did that happen? Can, can I add Wait a minute, wait, 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 okay. go ahead, tell okay. me. When I went over to her while she was still in the car, and the car was stopped while her car was on top of my car, and I say, this is my car, she goes, oh, don't worry about it. I'll pay for everything. I said, you're going to pay for these three cars that you just said. She's like, three yeah, cars. just help me get the car off. Just help me get the car down. Why are you guys going to call the police? How you going to get a 5,000 pound SUV off of the car? Why are we going to call the police? Wait a minute, wait, 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 excuse me. Yeah. Why didn't you just talk to the car? If the car put his...